The M230 chain gun is a 30mm, 30x113mm, single barrel chain driven auto cannon, using external electrical power to cycle the weapon between shots. It was designed and manufactured originally by Hughes Helicopters in Culver City, California. The company was acquired by McDonnell Douglas Helicopters in 1985, which merged into Boeing Corporation in 1997. In 2002, it was sold again to Alliant Tech Systems, which merged with Orbital Sciences Corporation in 2015 to form Orbital ATK and was, in turn, bought out by Northrop Grumman in 2018. As of 2019, it is produced by Northrop Grumman Innovation Systems. In 1972, Hughes Helicopters began a company-funded research effort to design a single machine gun to fire the U.S. Army's M50 20mm round. By April 1973, the program had fired test rounds in more powerful 30mm Wecom-linked ammunition from a prototype, a model. In January 1975 a Model C was added, a linkless version for the proposed advanced attack helicopter Yaw-64. The helicopter was eventually adopted as the Yaw-64 Apache, with the Model C as standard armament. The linked ammunition version was intended for use on the Yaw-1's Cobra as the M230E1, but was later dropped. The M230 chain gun is the area weapon system on the Boeing A64 Apache attack helicopter and is also used on the MH60L Direct Action Penetrator DAP. The M230 is mounted on the chin turret. It uses a 2 horsepower, 1.5 kilowatts electric motor to fire 30 mm, 1.2 in linkless ammunition at a rate of 625 plus or minus 25 rounds per minute. The practical rate of fire is about 300 rounds per minute, with a 10-minute cooling period as the gun is air-cooled. The mount on the A64 uses secondary hydraulics to move the gun. The elevation is provided via a single hydraulic actuator located on the gun's centerline just forward of the pivot point. The Apache is capable of carrying up to 1,200 rounds for the gun in a device known as the 12-pack, designed and manufactured by Megat Defense Systems Inc. However, utilization by the U.S. Army of a special internal fuel tank reduces this capacity to 300 rounds. The M230 is capable of firing the 30x113mm rounds used in the Aden Cannon and Defa Cannon, however, the lightweight 30mm rounds, M788, M789, M799, used in the M230 are constructed with a light alloy as opposed to brass, Aden, or steel, Defa, cases to save weight, and are in use with the U.S. Army. The M230 rounds are not backwards compatible with weapons designed for the Aden or Defa rounds. The M788 rounds can be distinguished by the blue band near the nose, the M789 by a yellow stripe atop a black band, and the M799 a red stripe atop a yellow band. The M789 is typically used in the M230. Each round contains 21.5 grams, 0.76 ounces, of explosive charge sealed in a shaped charge liner. The liner collapses into an armor-piercing jet of metal that is capable of penetrating 1 in 25 millimeters of rolled homogeneous armor at 500 meters. Additionally, the shell is also designed to fragment upon impact. The lethal radius against unprotected standing targets is about 5 feet 1.5 meters under optimum conditions. Variants M230LF and MAWS the M230LF, offered by Orbital ATK, is a more capable version of the Apache autocannon. Features include an anti-hangfire system, a delinking feeder that exploits linked ammunition, and an extended length barrel, which results in greater muzzle velocity and hitting power from the same M789 HEDP and NATO standard 30mm 8 and DEFA projectiles. The MAWS, Modular Advanced Weapon System, lightweight gun system, developed in partnership with the U.S. Navy, utilizes a remotely operated M230LF in an open mount. It is controlled by a remote operator's console, ROC with either dual grips or a joystick from, a touch panel display and extended day color TV. In February 2015, Oshkosh Defense and ATK conducted a firing demonstration of the M230LF on an Oshkosh MATV MRAP to demonstrate the viability and effectiveness of a medium-caliber weapon system for light tactical vehicles. The live-fire demonstration showcased improved accuracy and mobile engagements, 
and improved lethality on the MATV using the gun, mounted on the R400's MK2, a three-axis stabilized remote weapon station weighing less than 400 kilograms, 880 pounds. The addition of the 72.6 kg, 160 pounds, M230 LF stabilized on the RWS provides mobile precise lethality, usually reserved for heavier combat vehicles, with increased off-road mobility and MRAP levels of protection along with optional Stinger missiles. Oshkosh has also fitted the M230 LF to the LATV to fulfill the U.S. Army's Light Reconnaissance Vehicle (LRV) role 